The Art of Floundering Podcast presents Bad Cock Rising The Attack of the Giant Cock Part 2 Prologue Cock Buddy with special guests Hempy and friends Gee golly whiz Sativa you look beautiful Oh Hempy you say the sweetest things Gee gosh Indica you're so pretty Oh, Potsy, you're no slouch yourself. Gee whiz, it's really swell to be able to finally go out with all my bestest friends. Gee golly, you said it, Hempy. I guess you have to have a date to be considered a real friend. Gee golly, buddy, do you always gotta be such a Mr. Poopy Pants? Of course you can tag along with us, buddy. It's not your fault you're socially awkward. Come on, everybody, Potsy's ready to party. Yeah. Gee golly, you said it, Potsy! I am so sick of the way they treat me. Like I don't matter. Nobody has ever loved me. Not even my mommy. Gee whiz, peer group! We're finally here! Let's get our fucking party on! Gee golly, Hempy, you really know how to party! Hempy, you and Sativa are adorable. Come on, Sativa, work it, girl! What about me? I'm smart. I can figure things out. That's right, Indica. You know how Potsy likes it. Oh, Hempy, this is a magical evening. Just fighting for our rights to party, man. Gosh, Hempy, Sativa, I'm still here. Oh, it's you, buddy. Sorry, I didn't see you. Buddy, please don't feel insignificant. It's just hard to pay attention to you. Oh, look, Hempy, the stage is empty. Why don't you play us a song? Oh, gee, guys, I think he's gonna- Oh, Hempy, go, Hempy! Hey, guys, it's Buddy. I'm still here. Rock and roll, hoochie-coo, kids! Come on, Indigo. Let's go bust a move. Patsy, let's do the forbidden dance. I don't know, Sativa. Hempy's such an ass clown. You can do so much better. Buddy, I think Hempy's pretty swell. Come on, baby. Why fight it? You know what your body needs. Little buddy satisfied. Buddy, please get a hold of yourself. Take your hands off my old lady. Look, buddy, I know Sativa is a total piece of ass, so I don't want to turn this into a thing. She came on to me, man. Let's just agree to disagree, okay, pal? That's fine. I'll split, man. You guys are a drag anyway. Besides, I'm going to start my own band, so fuck you guys. Let's not have that ruin our night, gang. You said it, Hempy. Let's get our fuck on. Hey! One day I'll show those butt stains. But for the time being, I'm just going to walk around town in the middle of the night. Officer, please do something about that thing. Why is everybody so hostile to me, man? Well now, it's because I don't like your kind of people. I don't like to see you come into this good, clean area with your oily bud all dressed up. Passing yourself off as decent Americans. I'll tolerate you. But the fact is, I despise your masquerade. The dishonest way you possess yourself and your whole fucking entourage. Now why don't you get a move on before I lock you up? Thank you, officer, for sticking up for America. Oh man, you forgot to let them know about the giant cock alert. Well now, I didn't forget shit. Maybe a wild giant cock will take care of something that the law doesn't have the guts to handle. Wow, man, I'm overwhelmed with all the love. I think I'll go sulk in a dark corner. And what better night for it? It's totally safe. Besides, if it wasn't, that kind officer would have told me otherwise. Wow, kids, here we are. What a perfectly logical place for me to sulk. Ah! Ugh! Wow, man, this shit ain't cool. <laughs> Wow, man, nobody loves me. Welcome to our feature presentation of Attack of the Giant Cock, Part 2. Just when you thought it was safe to go out again. Oh, Chad, my darling, you can wake up. Yo, Karen, I thought you were dead, man. I thought I was dead. We were dead, Chad, but thanks to modern medicine, we got help. Well, now, Doc. It looks like we have three DOA, one male, Chad, 
two female, an officer flower and a Karen. Hey there, Barnes, stand down. I'm afraid that's not your call. You see, I'm the one who graduated Google Medical School, so I'm the only one who can make the DOA call. Get him into my OR, stat. Well now, Doc, they may be missing some vital parts. It's a gosh darn good thing I graduated Google Medical School. And thanks to that amazing doctor, we made it, Chad. Wow, man. This is like a second lease on life. Yeah, Chad, I feel like a schoolgirl again. A naughty schoolgirl, Chad. That's what I'm talking about, Karen. Let's get naughty. Drive it home, Chad. Drive it home. Yeah, Karen, I love laying pipe with you. Hey, you two. You gonna invite me to this party? Wow, Officer Flowers made it too. Fucking A and right on, man. I always wanted to get it on with my old lady and a cop. Oh, this is so naughty. Yeah, take charge, Chad. Take charge. Right on, man. I'm getting it on with my old lady and a cop. This is Peachy Keen. I'm exploding. It's like Niagara Falls. Yeah, man. Chad's getting ready to drop loads on the two of you. Golly gosh, that's pretty Peachy Keen. But what about our good pal, Officer Puller? Well, Officer Puller, it was touch and go. But it looks like you're gonna be okay. Ah, I bet you and such a good pal Officer Pola was a goner. But as I was running from Bubba, Bubba, I remembered something. I had some contraband hemp on my possession. Ah, here you ins go, Bubba. I know yous is a degenerate. Pacifying a giant cock with marijuana? That's uncanny, Officer Puller. How did you know this? Hey, Ewins. I don't have time to read the Bible to yous. It has to do with this degenerate Spanky. Wherever Spanky is, Bubba's not far behind. We need to find Spanky. I need to see the captain now. Gee golly, kids, it's Spanky time. Gee golly, Muffy, we're here. Gee gosh, Spanky. It's beautiful. Gee golly, Muffy. I even remembered to bring your favorite. Gee golly, Spanky, you think of everything. Gee golly, Muffy, I just think it's swell that you're gonna give me my first hand job and I wanted it to be real special for you. Golly, Spanky, you say the sweetest things, but I can't get over this feeling that somebody's watching us. Gee golly whiz, Muffy, that's just Bubba. Hey, ya fella. Gee golly, Spanky, he's such a big cock. Are you sure he's okay? Gee golly, Bubba's super nice. Come here, fella. Gee golly, you want to play fetch? Golly, fetch, Bubba, you can do it, Bubba. Gee golly whiz. Gee golly, you see, Muffy? Golly, Spanky. Are you ready for your first hand job? Gee golly, kids. Smoking weed and getting my first hand job. That's pretty gosh darn peachy keen. Bubba time. That's what I'm talking about. Jiminy gosh, what a huge cock. I wonder if he'll let me touch. Puller comes clean. Officer Puller? Can you explain to me how our marijuana detecting police cock became BFFs with Spanky, the most notorious juvenile delinquent we've known for some time? Ah, uh, Ewan's captain, you don't understand. It's not about Spanky, it's about the hemp. Hey there, Polar. It's no small secret that you're unhinged, especially when it comes to the hemp plant. Captain, you need to understand. Bubble is more than just a marijuana detecting police cock. His abilities were uncanny. He was able to detect that narcotic on anyone, even those nefarious, artsy, fartsy types. 
All right, enough, you ins degenerates. Step out of the car. Officer, not to be a poopy pants, but you need probable cause. Yeah, man, you need probable cause. Your sexual deviance is the only probable cause I need. Now I'm gonna let my cock go to work. What is the meaning of this? I am not comfortable being fondled by such a large cock. You ins keep still and zip it. Yous are dealing with state-of-the-art technology. Bubba, the marijuana detecting police cop. Go to work, Bubba. Go to work, Bubba. There you go, boy. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. You found it, Bubba. Good job, Bubba. Good job. Hey, pig. Fuck your cock, man. Ah, ah, you ins don't like the police cock. Ah! Do what you want with the girl, officer. Leave me alone. Ah, how you ins like me now, Shakespeare? Golly gee, Polar, I remember that collar. It was clean. By the book. Captain, you ins need to understand it was clean and by the book because of Bubba. That cock can detect marijuana on anyone. Anyone. Except... Banky. Gee golly willikers. Blowing grass is peachy keen. Gee golly, Spanky, it looks like you're getting high. Gee whiz, Hempy, I sure am. Gee golly gosh, Spanky, getting high is peachy keen. Gee golly, it certainly is, Potsy. Golly gee willikers, what have we here? Spanky the juvenile delinquent with his little narcotic playhouse. Gee golly, Polar, why don't you lighten the fuck up? Yeah, Officer Polar, you really need to chill. Golly gee, Officer Polar, why do you gotta be such a hard ass? Ollie, you ins, lock it up. I'm breaking out the cock. Gee golly, Polar, this is a waste of time. Gosh, Officer Polar, don't you think you need to be focusing on real crime? Ali G, Officer Polar, I think I have civil rights. Ali Ewins need to zip it and let that cock do his job. Bubba, Ewins have to be shitting me. Are you sure they're clean? Gee golly, Spanky, even though I know you're a degenerate, the cock doesn't lie. I'm gonna have to let you go. Gee golly, that's really too bad, Officer Polar. Gosh, Officer Polar, that is a shame. Like you said, the cock doesn't lie. Gee golly, so I guess you'll be on your way. Gee golly, Officer Polar, bye bye, see you never. Gee golly, Captain. Despite all that cock has done for this department, I started getting suspicious. After the shift was over, I made sure Bubba was okay. You ins get a good night's sleep, Bubba. I went to go stake out Spanky's house. Aha! And it was at that point my suspicions were confirmed. Gee golly, fella, it's you! Do you need a little something? Gee golly whiz, you poor thing. You just needed a little grass. I had no idea you knew how to handle such a big cock. What are you saying? Spanky was Bubba's hemp connection? Captain, you ins need to wise up. Bubba was already a hemp addict when this department acquired him. And Captain, I did a little bit more digging. I found out that Bubba came from a rather unique breeder, Penetron Cox. Good God, man. You mean... That's right, Captain. Penetron. Why would they want to have a marijuana addicted cock? Gee whiz, Captain, you ins knows the answer. There are a bunch of rat bastards at Penetron. Well, they fucked with the wrong cock this time. Officer Puller's gonna get to the bottom of this. A marijuana addicted, out of control police cock. I don't need to tell you to watch your ass on this one, do I, Puller? Captain, you ins knows I can't back down to a giant cock. Especially one that's addicted to the hemp plant. Polar, this is a huge cock that's out of control. You're gonna need backup. So I asked Officer Flower to pitch in. She whiz, Captain. A partner's just gonna slow me down. Polar, you can't take this cock on by yourself. It requires a tag team effort. We're all counting on you and Officer Flower to really put together a dynamic tag team effort on this one. And take down that gigantic marijuana craving cock once and for all. I, I, you ins, Captain. This concludes another episode of Attack of the Giant Cock from the Art of Floundering Podcast. Peace and love.